Hey you guys. Okay, so our first creativity challenge is going to be the take a walk challenge. And right now, I'm in downtown Prattville. You can see that city hall behind me. And I'm just kind of taking a walk down here. I'm gonna look for anything that catches my eye. Like, I already noticed that door right there. That setup right there is pretty cool. So I'm gonna take some pictures of that. And this, this challenge is all about looking for something that you wouldn't normally look for and seeing things in a way that you don't normally look at them. So I'm just gonna walk around down here and see if I can see anything that catches my eye and I'm gonna take a load of pictures and hope that maybe one or two will lend itself to something creative. And we'll see what happens from there. I like to try to incorporate that stuff into my art, see if I can try to, you know, create something new with stuff that's around me instead of constantly trying to create like abstract and different ideas. And um, what I also wanted to mention that is that if, you know, if you have some limitations where you can't get out and you can't get downtown, you know, maybe you don't live uh, near a city or, um, you know, COVID is an issue. So if, if you have any kind of limitations, maybe take a walk around the house. Um, I know, take a walk around your neighborhood. There's some stuff around the house in our neighborhood that we I could certainly, you know, take pictures of and use to incorporate in my art. So don't think you have to get to a downtown area. Just take a walk and look for things that maybe you wouldn't normally look for and see if you can incorporate any of that into your art. So here we go. I'm gonna start taking pictures and walking around and see what I see. So here, here we go. We'll see what I come up with. guys okay so I'm back in the shop yesterday I did my uh, take a walk downtown in Prival and I took a ton of pictures and this is the one I settled on it's huge it's the uh, fire hydrant and I did sort of like this um, Photoshop effect with the color and I'm gonna add some like background stripes back there that is that is my picture these stripes are actually uh from one of the bench pictures i just kind of photoshopped grabbed those bench stripes and used those and put them in the background
I'm super happy with how it turned out. I love the, the dramatic thick lines drawing your eye right to the hydrant. I added a little bit of color just to kind of set it off a little bit. So super happy with how it turned out. So even though I chose the fire hydrant for this creativity challenge, I actually have several other pictures that I think I can turn into art. So you may, as you find going through your pictures, if you can't decide on which thing to use, maybe do a few pieces, do two or three. I mean, you don't have to do just one. So good luck, you guys. I can't wait to see what you create. This is gonna be so much fun. Don't forget, hashtag P plus creativity. Thanks, you guys.